uh, good morning we are from SVS embedded so the project title name is called hand movement recognition system based on mouse using the MEMS sensor in this project we are using an 80 mega 16 and MEMS accelerometer 3 axis then this is an ADCIC and this here we are using an Zigbee module so I'll show the block diagram here uh, in our project we are using an uh, power supply section so MEMS ADXL335 in ADCIC and it is an uh, 3-axis XYZ coordinate and that is connected to ADC port to A.0 and here we are using an LCD display 16 cross 2 LCD display and here we are using an Zigbee module and a reset one crystal and a receiver end we are using an another Zigbee module and that is connected to the PC so this is an receiver module and that is connected with my PC using an RS-232 cable so in my project first of all I am using the two transformers both are continuous power supply if I use a battery sometime that the total currents will be lost so that's why I am using the transformer to continuous power will come otherwise if I be use a small battery it nothing will be happen we can execute the project First of all, this is an uh, you are um, normal uh, cable, uh, two pin element cable, and this is given to the two pin Berg pin. So here I am giving the red uh, red color LED that is called power supply section. So first of all, I am using the uh, bridge rectifier, filter capacitor, 7805 regulator. That entire section is called the power supply. So if I remove this one, that LED will not glow. So so after that this is a research switch if you are not getting anything on the LCD some garbage values we have to restart it and after that I am using a crystal it is a 16 megahertz crystal and it is a 1, mic 1 microsecond delay that is connected with the 12th pin and 13th pin of 80 mega 16 so I am using the 80 mega 16 so port A consists of uh, this is a total of 40 pin IC total 4 ports each port consists of port port uh, 8 pins total 32 input output bidirectional port A consists of ADC total 8 ADC pins are available port B port B I am using the ISP programming so I have a ISP programmer to dump the program onto the microcontroller using AVR ISP programmer ISP stands for in system programming and port C is connected to the 16 cross 2 LCD display so it is an character LCD display to display the data onto the LCD display and port D is connected to the max to uh, connected to the Zigbee module uh, and here I am using the Tarang module to, it is in 2.4 GHz frequency so I am transmitting the data to the another node that is called the receiver node that is connected to the PC and here I am using two switches one for the left and one for the right so these are only the indication I am using that which which we in a let us assume that we are taking a mouse mouse have a two push buttons those are left click and right click if you are not opening the file it is in clicking the options so here I am using the uh, MEMS, uh, M M M A ADXL double three file that is connected with 48th pin of X coordinate and 39th pin of Y coordinate so I am getting the X coordinate value and Y coordinate value X coordinate value Y coordinate value that are sending to the through Zigbee so so uh, first of all uh, so I am getting uh, I am giving the power supply so uh, the microcontroller will go for these MEMS after that it is connected to the Zigbee then the value should be sent through the PC then the value should be sent through the PC so in my PC I am using here also I am using the same uh, receiver end in that receiver end I am using an uh, uh, bridge rectifier filter capacitor 7805 regulator and an max 232 that is connected to the PC ok the, here I am here I'm giving the RS-232 cable uh, so this is an 2.4 gigahertz that is transmitter section and this is an receiver section so we receive the data so in my PC I am using one uh, tool that tool is called uh, that tool is called uh, hand mouse using uh, developed by vb.net so let it, I am giving one uh, uh, X file to you that uh, when I clicking this uh, so you will get the data so the mouser will be uh, here so if I if I play if I shaking this one 
means according to the according according when i tilting this angle that the value should be goes on changing okay so the uh, if if i am changing the tilting at the angle if i press this it's called if i press this button left click means it will show like that so the dialog box will be displayed means if uh, so we we need to escape means it will be gone and if i am pressing the right switch continuously then that it is giving as a right right button is pressed so that the value will be changed so i am minimizing this and we can uh, uh, we can change this one according to our environmental so the mouse will be rotate now that cursor will be rotate so this is an sample program as per they are given by one vb.net person so let me know if there is any problems as you assembled it